Hey everyone, I'm back y'all with another video. So, y'all know we just got out of a full moon. I know a lot of times full moons can bring so much uh, to the forefront. We're also going through uh, retrogrades at this time. So a lot of things could have could be coming to the surface, okay? So let's go ahead and get into it. Let's see what's what's going on with the collective. Scrap the energy, and we're gonna talk about it. All right. What's going on with the collective, please? What does the collective need to know? Oh wow. Oh. The way that jumped out, yeah. I'm seeing that somebody is saying, honey, if you ain't got no receipts about this love affair, this right here, then you ain't, you ain't got nothing. You ain't got a damn thing. Somebody's looking for some receipts. Somebody looking for some receipts, honey. Yes, if somebody wants some receipts about somebody being together. We got benching. Somebody's thinking that the grass was greener. Oh, then they stalking you. They watching you. They watching to see if you throwing shade, if you throwing shots, okay? So you may have blocked this person online. You may have unfriended them or you may have turned your back on this person because you need some receipts. And they spying to see if you throwing shade too. We got cap and put on blast. So somebody could have got put, you could have put somebody on blast and they lied. They lied about it. The texter. And there may be communication coming in from this person or this person could be trying to reach out to you via text message or there are receipts. Like, is there some kind of receipts? Like, is there a text message? Is there a screenshot? Like, yeah, because I got spilling the tea and millennial. This person could be younger. Somebody is being called out. Like, somebody being called out. We got slut shaming. Somebody getting called out. But it's somebody saying you don't got the receipts. How can you prove it? No proof is what I'm hearing. And then we got by Felicia. I'm telling you, somebody saying you don't got the proof. You don't got no proof. Okay, then bye. How can you prove it? Hmm. Yeah, this is a melancholy drama is freak. Okay. I'm getting somebody could have stopped messaging, stop all around like communicating. There's no communication. Um, but I'm getting like somebody saying, Look, what proof do you have of this connection? If you don't have no proof, then then bye. All right, so we're going to put some tarot on it, and we're going to see what's good. Let's see what's going to win. Dang. I should have had my other deck, but I'll use these. Whew, okay. What's going on, Spirit? What's going on, Spirit? Show me what's going on with the collective. 
Yeah, there's some secret. Somebody, you could be digging for information. You could be digging for some information. I see like there's some type of secret, something that's supposed to be a secret. Somebody's pissed off. Knight of Swords and the Page of Swords. I told you there's a lot of spying going on. Mm. Somebody's pissed about some information that has got to them. And it's about the Seven of Swords energy. Somebody is a liar, cheat, sneak. Yeah, something. Look at this. Four of Cups. There's disappointments. Pissed off. I'm getting real pissed off energy for sure because why is the Four of Wands here? This could have been family. Somebody was going to try to take this secret to their deathbed. You hear me? This was something I was supposed to uh, never be told. Yep. Two of, so two of Pentacles and the Seven of Swords. This person is going to keep up with this lie. They're not going to tell the truth. Because if you got the Ace of Swords over here, I see you wanting this truth to be revealed. You hope that this person would tell the truth. But this person over here, they're hiding. They're trying to block this out. They're trying to avoid having this confrontation with you. They're trying to avoid you asking them too many questions. Um, like I said, they was going to take this to the grave. Okay? They was going to take this secret to the grave. They spying on you to see if you mad. Yeah. I'm hearing a love story. Like Knight of Swords, this could be something that happened in somebody's like younger years with that Knight of Swords. That's very young, childlike energy. So I'm seeing a love story with the lovers and the temperance here. So this is like a love story. So somebody could be married or this involves a group of people or family. Uh, why is the moon here? Six of swords. Yeah, this person mad because this secret got out. You hear me? This person is mad because this secret done got out. Look at this. This could involve. We got the King of Wands, the Emperor, and the Empress. This is sticking out. Okay. This is sticking out. The Emperor, that's the father energy. The Empress is the mothering energy. So this could involve a husband or a wife. A power couple of some sort, a Aries or a Libra or a Taurus, or a baby mother and a baby father. Okay, there could be a third person involved who is this King of Wands, Leo, Sagittarius, Aries energy. Um, but this person was trying to was you know trying to keep this energy away from you. They felt like if you found that out, you was gonna be mad as hell. Somebody did something for fun. Could be a Leo involved. Um, and this happened in the past. I'm hearing that was a long time ago. Six of Cups and the Eight of Cups. That was, that was some time back. Okay, somebody was a breadwinner. Somebody was on top of their game. King of Pentacles, Six of Wands. So somebody was very successful financial-wise. Could have had their own business. Could have been like the top dog in a circle. And somebody was... 
possibly in a relationship. You could have been in a relationship with this person. This person wants to, feels like they should apologize. This person feels like they should apologize, but they not. I, didn't I just get this? I just got this same energy the other day with the collective breed. Y'all go back and check out um, they're secretly watching you or something like that. That I just had the same energy. They're not going to. They're not going to. This could definitely be a family member. I'm getting, I know we family and all, but that don't mean, that don't matter. Feel like if that's what they want to do, then that's what they're going to do. But they actually having regrets. They actually having regrets. But that's how they coming off. Like, it don't matter. Hmm. This person kind of giving me faith off of soul food type vibes. Because <laughs> I feel like there's somebody that you are close to or you thought you and this person was close. Why is the page of swords here? Okay. This person's fine to see if you're gossiping about them, if you're talking about them. Yeah, I'm hearing that was old. Okay, somebody had sex with somebody. Somebody had sex with somebody's girlfriend or boyfriend. Could be a Capricorn. Um... It could be somebody's baby daddy, baby mother. This person could have wanted to want up you. This person wanted to one up you, so they went behind your back. They stabbed you in the back, possibly for some, some, look at this ace of wands. What does it look like? A penis. This could have been somebody's friend or somebody that's close, somebody that's in a circle. It's somebody's baby daddy or father or uncle or something. Got the emperor. I'm here. Ask him what he said. Ask him what he did. Could have been some money involved. Lots of money involved. And this person was the third party. Queen of Wands and the Three of Swords. Definitely giving me little ho vibes. Okay, so, I mean. Yes, and here's the Empress and the Strength card. Okay, so definitely a male and a female. Like, that's supposed to be together. That are each other's counterparts, each other's soulmates, or twin flame, or baby mother, baby father, husband, wife. So it's some type of really strong connection here. Somebody wanted to one-up you. Look at this. Yeah, it's the sun and the knight of wands. This is definitely something sexual that it was supposed to just be something casual, something to do. Um, somebody started to feel bad about it. Somebody could have been trying to get your attention, and that's how this information ends up coming out.
somebody's scared to fight or think that you want to fight them. Um, but I feel like if you're looking for information, you're going to get exactly what you're looking for. Because somebody tried to one-up somebody. Either this is rumor or this is already happened or this is getting ready to prepare you. Prepare yourself for this. Because I feel like something that was a secret is no longer a secret anymore. Okay? So that's the message that I got. Um, yeah, so let me know what's going on in the comment section below, guys. And I'm going to chat with y'all later.